Hey everybody, thank you so much for joining me today. Today I have another Green Chef unboxing. Green Chef is one of my favorite meal kits, so let's check it out and see what's inside. This is how it arrives. We have the recipe cards on top, and this week I have three different recipes and two servings in each recipe. We have spicy sesame shrimp, beef cavatappi skillet, and chicken with garlic spinach rice. When it arrives, everything is insulated. It does have an ice pack on top. Underneath the ice pack, we have everything divided into meal kits. It's the chicken meal kit, the shrimp meal kit, and the meal kit for the beef cavatappi skillet. At the very bottom of the box, we have another ice pack. And this is where you'll find the meat for the recipes. We have chicken cutlets, ground beef, and white shrimp. First of all, let's check out the ingredients for the chicken and garlic spinach rice. Spinach, almonds, Italian seasoning, rice, apricot jam, garlic, chicken stock concentrate, and chili flakes. The spicy sesame shrimp, we have a cabbage and carrot mix, broccoli, chili flakes, toasted sesame oil, onion, black and white sesame seeds, roasted cashews, garlic, and spicy ginger lime aioli. And the last one, the beef cavatappi skillet. Cavatappi, ooh, roasted red peppers, peas, cream cheese, mozzarella, Tuscan heat spice, tomato cream sauce, Parmesan cheese, and chili flakes. First recipe is chicken with garlic spinach rice. I boiled the rice with the water and chicken stock concentrate and let that simmer for about 18 minutes. Next, I dried the chicken cutlets and I seasoned those with the Italian seasoning. I cooked those in oil for about six minutes on each side. Next, I added the minced garlic to some oil and then added the spinach and I let that cook for about three minutes. And the last step was to make the sauce. This was my favorite part. I added the apricot jam, the chicken stock concentrate, and some water. I actually left out the chili flakes this time. I let that simmer and then I added a tablespoon of butter. And then next I added the cooked rice to the pan with the spinach. And here we have our final dish. This was amazing. I added the chicken to each plate with some garlic spinach rice. And then I added the sauce on top. I decided to leave the almonds out. So this is my final meal. Here is the photo challenge. And here's the empty plate. Such a hit, I will definitely make this one again. Next, I made the spicy shrimp. I minced the garlic, and then I added that to some oil and added the shrimp. I let that cook for about four minutes, and then I added the toasted sesame oil. Once again, I left out the chili flakes. When that was finished, I added the broccoli and onion to a hot pan. After it cooked for about four minutes, I added the cabbage and carrots, the cashews, and some water. Here is a look at my final plate. This meal was super quick and easy to make. Here is a look at the photo challenge. One of my favorite parts was the spicy ginger lime aioli. I did a lot more than a drizzle because it was so amazing. And that's it, another delicious Green Chef meal. The last Green Chef meal of the week is the beef cavatappi skillet. I started cooking the beef with some Tuscan heat sauce. Once that was browned, I added the cavatappi pasta, half of the tomato cream sauce, some water and salt and pepper. This reminded me a lot of a fancy hamburger helper. I put the top on and let that simmer for about 10 minutes. Next, I added the cream cheese. This is also where you add the peas, but I left those out. Next, I added the roasted red peppers and the remaining tomato cream sauce and two more tablespoons of water. I let that cook for about three more minutes and then I sprinkled it with the Parmesan cheese and the mozzarella cheese. And finally, I put that in the oven to broil for about two minutes so the cheese could melt. And here we have it. This was a delicious pasta dish, another super easy meal. Here is the photo challenge. It was three for three this week. We loved all of these meals and would definitely order each of them again. That was everything in this week's Green Chef order. If you're interested in trying Green Chef, I will have a coupon code in the description below. So be sure to check that out. And as always, thank you so much for watching and please subscribe.